good morning it is sunday today which means i work my job pretty much consists of pulling up to the park setting up a net teaching the fundamentals of how to play volleyball you know passing setting hitting serving i have arrived gotta make sure i don't burn myself because that would not be the ooh, the fucking oil came out i hate wearing sunscreen but i know it's good for me oh my god i'm crying And just like that, I'm done I'm thinking about whether or not I go get a drink or something because I just got paid and it's hot and I want to celebrate that the week is over. Time isn't real, but still. So I don't know. Good day. The kids were chill today. They're so funny. I love the group I have. I'm home. This is my after work snack. But no worries. I'm actually going to make food. I'm going to start making a pizza. Stolen recipe from one of my first jobs. It is a barbecue chicken. It's got barbecue instead of the regular tomato sauce because I don't fuck with that type of sauce. It's got bacon, pineapple chicken, and uh, cebolla. It's got cebolla too. And it's really good. I don't have a lot of time left. I have to leave in like 15 minutes, but I'm gonna try getting in as much as this episode as possible just because like I'm hooked. The show's great. Welcome to MVBC. This is where I play Revco and where I'm gonna be chilling for the next four hours. Four games. I'm dripping sweat. Oh my God. Here I am eating some of my leftover pizza after Revco with my winter melon lemonade, obviously. Good morning, it is Monday, which means today I practice. So here's me getting ready, grabbing my water bottles, putting my knee pads on and everything. Let's freaking go. This is literally the only part of campus I actually know. I have been here for three years. Four hours done, now wait. Yay. Enjoying some winter melon lemonade green tea concoction I made. Some ceviche my mom made and chips. Yummy. I'm finally home. I'm a journal real quick, take a lap and go to sleep. Hopefully, fingers crossed, cause oh my God, I woke up so tired today. I need the sleep. Good morning, it is Tuesday. Today I have two shifts, so I'm gonna get ready, head over to my first shift at my college. After practice, I got home, I showered, I ate something quickly, then I took my sister to cheer practice. Since I was in the area, I decided to stop by my favorite boba place to get a drink. Once I got home, I hopped onto the Mizuno website because bitch, I need new volleyball shoes. And now that I've hopefully fixed my shoe problem, I'm gonna bust out my volleyball notebook and do a little post-practice debrief. Normally I write down stuff that I did well, stuff I can improve on, and some notes that I got from my teammates, etc. But today I got some notes from coach and I wanna get them down in writing because I feel like if I keep it all in my head, I'm just gonna get overwhelmed and shut down. I feel like writing this stuff down helps push all those notes into my subconscious and then I can gradually make changes as opposed to just having them bounce around in my brain. I'm doing my notes, but Tigra has other plans. Top of the night shift. Let's turn my water into slushies real quick though. Boom. And done. Wednesday, halfway through the week. Not gonna lie, the fatigue is really like hitting me hard today. My body felt really heavy while I was practicing. Like during the warmups, I just felt so tired. And then when I was getting home, my eyes were just like closing and I just feel so dead. I've been going to sleep by like 2.30 in the morning for the past, I wanna say month, something like that. I don't know, it's just, it's not it. Even though I don't wake up super early, I'm still waking up at like 9.30 and going to sleep at like 2.30. So I'm getting max seven hours. And they're not even good hours because I'm opening my eyes every once in a while. I'm like, I don't know. My sleep is really fucked up. Anyway, so this is how I'm gonna continue that cycle. 
I'm cooking up some chorizo so I can make some tacos and eat that. And I'm thinking about watching the last episode of House of the Dragon, but on the big screen. Because I feel like it did not have the impact that it was supposed to have. Because I watched it on my phone. It's not the same watching it on the phone and watching it on a big ass motherfucking screen. So that's probably what I'm going to do. And it's barely like 930 so if I can go to sleep at like 12, that'd be amazing. Like latest 12. Cross my fingers, cause that is so early for me. <laughs> and yeah, that's pretty much Wednesday. On to Thursday. Today is my last day of practice at school. Here's me trying to work on my serve because this is a new skill I'm acquiring. It's been about four years, but I'm still acquiring the skill. I really want to be able to do a top spin jump serve, but the thing is, it is so inconsistent. And also, I've been noticing that this week I've been, I don't know if it's just like the fatigue or what, but it just feels like my brain is just like off. Like, it's just getting overwhelmed. There's so much going on. There's so many things I have to learn and adapt to. And also, my body's just really tired because I don't sleep well. There's days where I literally play eight hours. I feel like I just need to take care of myself a little more. I am so dead right now <sighs> we got some food with my aunt and now i'm gonna get ready to play because i play from 9 30 until one or whenever we start until one because today is one of those full days let's go Friday, I just straight up didn't do anything. I just laid on my floor and stared at the ceiling. Then Saturday, I just had work and then just stared at the ceiling, fed my little brother, that's it. <laughs> right now, I'm working on a script for a video. I really hope I actually finish it, film it, edit it, upload it but I'm procrastinating a lot. It's been like six months since I originally conceived of this idea. But yeah, that's pretty much what a week looks like. There's a lot going on during the actual weekdays. I play a lot of volleyball as you guys can tell. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Fingers crossed, I really like me pongo las pilas and I start making more videos because I feel like I just compartmentalized my love for making videos right now it's like i'm maxing out my volleyball hours but i'm just completely forgetting about all my other hobbies and passions like music production studying korean painting drawing video making all of those other things that i enjoy doing reading like or well, listening to huh? books because we all know i don't like reading <laughs> i can't concentrate i feel like right now i'm just really focusing on volleyball like that's my main thing as you can probably tell so hopefully i'm able to actually balance out my hobbies and not just go full gung-ho for volleyball that's a week in my life pre-season <laughs> thank you so much for watching here's some other videos you guys can check out if you're feeling like it see you if and when you choose to come back bye bye